Hello, I'm Hayden and I'm explaining the stage three of our three stage plan. This stage is suitable for you if you want to progress from stage two of our muscle strengthening exercises for bones, or if you feel stage two would be too easy for you. I'm going to show you one exercise from each group that's hinge, push, pull and squat. If you're going to do the hinge, push and squat exercise in stage three, it's really important you get guidance and supervision from a qualified instructor before attempting them, especially if you have osteoporosis and are focused on caring for your back. The pull exercise is one you could try at home. You need to do these exercises with the care and proper technique to make sure you're not putting too much strain on your back. If you're exercising from home, we recommend sticking to the hinge, push and squat exercises in stage two, as these generally don't require guidance from a specialist. You can still progress in stage two by making your weights heavier or shortening or choosing thicker resistance bands. The hinge exercise I'm going to show you in stage three is the barbell Romanian deadlift. It's a progression from the band-resisted Romanian deadlift in stage two. So here I'm going to grab the barbell from the rack, keep my back nice and straight. I'm going to hinge at the hips, and bring that as low as you can until you feel that stretch in the hamstrings. Keep your back nice and flat throughout. With this, I want you to do eight to 12 repetitions with three sets as well. The push exercise in stage three we're going to do is the overhead press. This is progression from the stage two press up. So here, I'm going to grab the bar on the front rack right here. Stand shoulder width apart with your feet and get your back nice and straight, your core tight. Turn it to the rack. Again, I'd like you to do an eight to 12 repetitions of three sets. I'm demonstrating so you can understand the principles. Some of you may reach the level where these are the best way to build your muscle strength. But just to stress, don't go out and buy and use weights in this way without instruction. As you'll see, by increasing the weight you're using, it will increase the intensity of the muscle resistance. The pull exercise in stage three is a single arm dumbbell row, and it's a progression from the single arm band assisted row in stage two. You could do this exercise at home if you're comfortable with it and you have a weight available. I want you bending over at the hips, keeping your back nice and straight, grabbing the dumbbell and using your other arm as support, and you're gonna pull the dumbbell into your midline. And again, set on the bench when you're finished. Again, make sure you do both arms for eight to 12 repetitions and for three sets with a rest in between them. In stage three, the squat exercise is called the barbell squat and it's a progression from the hands-free squat in stage two. I'm going to take the barbell on the upper back, walk out of the squat rack with your feet just outside hip width and you're going to come down to as low as you feel comfortable. Try and keep your back nice and straight, core tight. Walk it back into the rack. And again, I'd like you to do between eight and 12 repetitions with the rest, I'm doing this for three sets. And finally, I'm going to show you a brace, lunge and step exercise. Remember, you can do a brace exercise and either a lunge or step once or twice a week to help your body get used to new ways of moving. The stage three brace exercise is a progression from the kneeling plank in stage two. We're gonna move on to a full plank now. So having your arms underneath your shoulders, keep your back nice and straight, and you're gonna hold this position, tucking your tummy in, keeping your muscles nice and tight. I want you to aim to do 20 to 30 seconds, and again, for three sets with a rest in between each set. The lunge exercise I'm going to show you is called a dumbbell lunge. We're gonna bend down, keep your back nice and flat, and straight, pick up the dumbbells, and we're gonna step forward change legs. And again, I want you to do eight to 12 repetitions on both legs for three sets with the rest in between. The exercise from the step group is called the barbell step up and it's progression from the step up in stage two. I'm going to be holding the barbell on my back and stepping up onto the step. It's essentially you have good balance and technique here, so consider working within the structure if you want to increase the intensity using a barbell.
Again, I would like you to do eight to 12 repetitions for three sets on both sides of your legs and have a rest in between them. That's the end of a progressive muscle resistance training plan designed to help your bone strength. I hope learning about the plan has given you ideas to create your own program with confidence.